The time has come. As you can see behind me, the Steam Deck finally supports Windows at last. And this is one of the big features that I've been excited to try ever since they announced the Steam Deck. Being able to potentially run Windows alongside SteamOS's default Linux operating system. And I cannot wait to try it. There's so much to be excited about. Uh, being able to run games that you can't run on Linux. Um, like Call of Duty, Warzone, um, Apex Legends, some of these big big online multiplayer games that have anti-cheat systems that they just can't port over into Linux, including Fortnite. So, yeah, Windows is now running on the Steam Deck, and we're going to go check it out and check this article out. But before we do, hold back, hold on a second. Please, please consider clicking the like button down below, clicking the subscribe and clicking the bell icon, because I'll be having, I'll be giving more I'll be putting out more Steam Deck content over the coming days and weeks, um, and I'll be, be I'll be getting my hands on my own Steam Deck within any week now, maybe next week, maybe the week after, but very soon, very soon. So please smash that subscribe button, smash the bell icon next to it, so you get notified when I post more Steam Deck content. Um, and yeah, join our little family, please, please subscribe. Anyways, let's get into the article, courtesy of The Verge. Let's go. So let me know what you think about this. It seems like in the Steam Deck community, people are really divided or people are leaning more towards the whole, I don't need Windows. I hate Windows. I can't wait to get away from Windows. I've got no need for Windows on the Steam Deck. But there is a community, myself included, who want the option to run Windows because as you know, um, SteamOS uses something called Proton, Proton, which basically translates Windows games over to Linux. Now, not all games support are supported by Proton or work with Proton, but there is an ever-growing list all the time. So, I mean, if you want the most vanilla, pure Steam Deck experience, the most slick, optimized Steam Deck experience um, with the SteamOS, um, obviously keep SteamOS Linux, Linux on your Steam Deck. Um, and play the Steam Deck the way it was intended. But if you want to push the limits, break through barriers, break through steel ceilings, um, you can. And you can install Windows and install all the games that don't work in Proton, um, play them, play games with anti-cheat systems, and really just use your Steam Deck as literally a Windows computer. Um, and now you can do it. So anyways, let's get into the article. The Steam Deck can now run Windows. Yes! Hallelujah! Valve offers no Windows support. That's to be expected. And, well, that's not to be expected. Hold on. Come on a second, Valve. Come on. Give us some Windows support. I know you I know you want to tout your own Steam OS, but come on. Um... And the speakers, the speakers won't work yet. That's a little bit of a bummer, but that's okay. Valve's, um, I'm sure they'll update that very soon. Valve shipped its $400 handheld gaming console, the Steam Deck, before all the promised features were ready. But one of the biggest is now here. You can install Windows 10 on a Steam Deck and actually expect it to work because Valve has just released the all-important GPU, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth drivers you'll need to download and play games. Um, importantly, you'll need to wipe a you'll need to wipe a Steam Deck to do this. There's no dual boot yet, and Valve says you can only install Windows 10 since the Steam Deck's current BIOS apparently doesn't include firmware TPM support, which Microsoft infamously requires for Windows 11. Oh, and you, I'm sure they'll allow you to install Windows 11 at some point. Um, but for now, install Windows 10. It's more reliable. It's more optimized anyway. Um, I've not I've not upgraded any of my PCs to Windows 11 yet. Oh, I tell like my my Asus gaming laptop. I have done that um, only because it kind of sort of egged me on to do it. But yeah, Windows 10 should be fine on it. Um, your speakers and headphone jack won't work because there's no audio drivers yet. Bluetooth or USB C audio are both options for now. So Bluetooth, if you have Bluetooth headphones, should work fine. USB audio should work fine too. Um, I'm sure it's. It's not going to be long before we see, you know, the drivers for the audio on the Steam Deck for Windows. Um, it's a pretty big deal, the fact that the speakers don't work on Windows 10 yet. But if you have Bluetooth headphones like myself, most of you probably do. I've got earbuds, I've got headphones. Then you should be, you should be pretty, you should be fine. Um, I've also got a USB-C dongle um, with my Arctis 7X gaming headset here, which I should be able to just plug into the top of the Steam Deck and play with a proper gaming headset when I'm playing it. So that should be fine too. Um, but yeah, hopefully those drivers are released soon. They're all, they've obviously released the Wi-Fi, um, Bluetooth, and the graphics drivers, so the audio drivers won't be far behind. Um, but yeah, um, awesome. And I'm sure they'll also update um, the Steam. Uh, I'm sure they'll somebody, maybe Valve, maybe someone else, will make it easier to dual boot between Steam OS and Windows. Someone will do it. Um, it'll just take a little bit of time. I'm sure there'll be YouTube tutorials too. But yeah, back to the article. You can find Valve's Windows and Steam Deck 
right page right here and the steam deck recovery instructions right here in case you screw up or run into some of the deck's unfortunate bugs to get into the boot menu power down then while holding volume down click the power button right valve um i should note that the steam deck isn't quite as buggy today as it was during the review process and the updates aren't coming as fast and furious after launch um valve created stable and beta release channels you can access right from the deck interface i've still had some crashes on games that mysteriously stopped working the way they did days or weeks before looking at you vampire survivors but i've also played hours of elven ring and into the breach without issues i'll be firing up windows 10 on my own review unit soon so stay tuned cool um so let's take out let's check out that windows and deck page right um right here um oh it's they really they're really not like promoting it are they um so basically um windows resources steam deck windows resources steam deck as a pc and other applications and os's can be installed if you're installing windows you will need a few additional drivers to have the best experience links to these along with the notes for installing on steam deck can be found below we're providing the, these resources as is and are, and are unfortunately unable to offer windows and deck support if you get stuck and need a way back to the default steam deck os please follow these recovery instructions i wish they were supporting it a little bit more i mean come on guys come on it can't be that hard to support gpu driver download here run setup.exe to install wi-fi driver download here bluetooth driver audio drivers are still being worked on by amd and other parties this document will be updated once those drivers are available until those drivers are available speakers and the 3.5 millimeter audio port will not provide audio USB-C or bluetooth can provide audio in the meantime um so cool Dual boot with SteamOS is not yet available, so they're saying that it might be available in the future. Installing Windows requires you to wipe your Steam Deck and dual boot with SteamOS is not currently available. While Steam Deck is fully capable of dual boot, the SteamOS installer that provides a dual boot wizard isn't ready yet. This will ship alongside SteamOS 3. What's this coming? Yes! They're gonna they're gonna build it into the wizard. Um notes for installing Windows to get the la, la, la. cool. So there we go. Windows 10 is now support on the Steam Deck yes i know a lot of you guys in the comments who love the steam deck have a steam deck maybe or are wanting to buy one don't really care about windows um i've seen it over the reddit um i've seen it on the comments of youtube videos people just seem or at least the majority of people seem really disinterested in even like using windows under steam deck for which reason i don't know why just because yeah windows isn't maybe the best operating system but it's it's it, the stuff you can run is limitless you know the stuff you can run on windows there's no there's no limit like you don't have to fiddle around with linux to try and get stuff running it just works um so yeah i'll, I'll probably be installing windows on mine potentially in the future when they allow dual booting i might not do it straight away because i have seen a lot of positive experiences on the default steam os um, but it's something i can't wait to try and especially on steam os 3 they're saying they're going to allow you to dual boot it's fully capable of dual booting um so hopefully we can be able to switch between steam os and windows and obviously share the hard drive space where the games are and it should work fine so awesome yeah i'm i'm hyped <laughs> let me know what you think in the comments and please again subscribe because trust me there's going to be a lot more steam deck content on this channel and if you want to stay tuned for more of it and see the steam deck in my hands please click that subscribe button and also most importantly click the bell icon and if you like this video and if you like steam deck stuff in general smash the thumbs up button down below i'd really appreciate it anyways guys i love you and also if you want to support the channel and support more steam deck content and support me and support everything we do everything that i do um then please consider clicking the join button and joining the cult i mean clan of blaze 2k um and join our little family anyways guys have an amazing day take care enjoy the rest of your week i love you is blaze 2k signing out can't wait for my steam deck can't wait yes come on steam deck <laughs>